Welcome to Liver Live. This is the YouTube channel that will bring Liverpool fans the latest news of the club in our hearts. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications to support me. Liverpool and Man United submit offers for Josko Gvardiol as a dream club revealed. Gvardiol, 21, was thought to be on the verge of a move to Manchester City earlier this month, but RB Leipzig sporting director Max Eberl insisted there is no agreement between the German club and the Premier League champions. In a turn of events, Liverpool, Manchester United, and Chelsea have arrived on the scene as the race for the Croatian signature heats up. According to Spanish publication Fitches, all three English clubs are placed on red alert and have even submitted offers to try and hijack the defenders' move to the Etihad. The report adds that City remain firm favourites to sign Gvardiol. But the competition is fierce. Leipzig are reluctant to see their prized asset leave the club having already lost Dominic Sabasli to Liverpool this summer, but have reportedly set a €100 Euros, £86 million pounds, price tag for Gvardiol. Indeed, Liverpool may have a slender advantage in the race for his signature if his previous comments are anything to go by. Speaking to TV channel RTL Danas in January, Gvardiol revealed Liverpool was his dream club, my dream club, that would definitely be Liverpool. Since I was little, I watched a lot of their matches with my dad, we covered every season in detail. It is a club that has remained in my heart. Liverpool not in the race with Real Madrid for Kylian Mbappé. Kylian Mbappé's future continues to be a never-ending subject of discussion and debate in the media as contrasting reports keep popping up about his next move. Today is the deadline for the 24-year-old to decide on extending his contract until 2025, which he has announced that he does not wish to do. As such, PSG remain intent on offloading him this summer instead of losing him for free next summer. Real Madrid remain the favourites to sign Mbappé even though clubs like Al Hilal are putting up world record sums in terms of both transfer fees and salary to convince him. Amidst this, there had been talk of Liverpool entering the race for Mbappe as well, but Rodrigo Fires of ESPN is now reporting that the Premier League giants are not among the contenders to sign the Frenchman. It had been suggested in some media outlets that Mbappe could join Liverpool on a season-long loan deal, with the player and his mother both open to the move. Liverpool prepare improved Romeo Lavia offer. Southampton expect a big week regarding Romeo Lavia with Liverpool, Chelsea and Manchester United all targeting the midfielder. Liverpool, armed with cash from the sales of Fabinho and Jordan Henderson, will make an improved bid for the 19-year-old. The Reds saw their first approach of £35 million plus add-ons turned down by Saints, with the championship club wanting £50 million. Liverpool boss Jurgen Klopp has stressed the club must strengthen their midfield after Henderson moved to Al Etifak for £12 million, while Fabinho is poised to join fellow Saudi Arabian side Al Ittihad for £40 million. Lavia is the first choice to replace the outgoing duo, it's definitely important to strengthen in midfield. Klopp said during Liverpool's pre-season tour in Singapore. We have to do something, that is clear, we are working on solutions. First people want changes, now everyone is worrying about the changes. We are really optimistic about it. Excited as well, Chelsea have maintained contact too, with the Blues still yet to find an agreement with Brighton for their pound 100m rated midfielder Moises Caicedo. A foreign club and Manchester United are the surprise elements still in the mix for Lavia. United would have to sell first while Sofian Amrabat at around £25 million is a much cheaper and ready-made option. Liverpool have not stepped in for Amrabat as it stands. The Anfield club are closing on another midfield prospect though, 16-year-old Trey Nioni from Leicester City. Liverpool will hold Rafael Benitez meeting to discuss £34 million transfer as compromise offered. Liverpool have reportedly held talks with former boss Rafael Benitez to try and work out an agreement to sign Gabri Vega this summer. Jurgen Klopp has spoken openly about his wish to sign another central midfielder with Jordan Henderson leaving and Fabinho set to also depart. Romeo Lavia appears to be the priority target after having an initial bid turned down by Southampton. But alternative options are still being explored while Liverpool are also planning for the future. The Reds have already made drastic changes in midfield as Henderson has joined James Milner, Naby Keita and Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain out the door. Thiago Alcantara is also entering his final year at Anfield with the expectation that he'll be allowed to leave as a free agent in 2024, that would leave Liverpool needing to find another midfield replacement and the Reds seemingly want to act now to avoid leaving themselves short.
While Lavia appears to be a target to bring in right now, it's suggested by transfer expert Ben Jacobs that Liverpool want a deal in place for Vega to join next year. It's claimed that a senior Liverpool figure has already held talks with Benitez, who took over at Celta Vigo this summer. The report goes on to state that there's a possibility of a deal being agreed this summer where Vega would be loaned back to Celta Vigo for the upcoming season. Liverpool struck a similar deal with RB Leipzig in 2017 for the signing of Keita, who joined a year later. Vega has a £34 million release clause in his current contract, but he's said to want an instant game time, which Liverpool may not be able to offer him this year. And that's the end of this video, don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications to support me.